Good evening, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I wanted to share briefly a few items with you all that were purchased this weekend and um, the palettes that I found probably about a year ago um, from the beauty supply store and I'm just now getting around to using them. So today I am wearing the Sugar Coat Palette. I also purchased the Spiced Up Palette. This is the NK um, brand. They were about $5.99. So I used the brown in this palette, which is this shade right here. I also used this um, Champagne Toast. Um, the colors don't, <laughs> the um, shadows don't actually ha actually have names. I'm just making up a name for it. But it's like a, a peachy champagne color. And then I use this peach color um, under my lower lash line. And I use this um, gold color in my um, inner corners. And I've had this makeup on now for about since about five so maybe about six or seven hours um i purchased a new brush um, i have been showing you all this brush which this is this is a bh cosmetics brush and it came in a set um it's like a flat top brush um, but it's really soft and i use it to press in the foundation on my face I have another one that I purchased from Real Techniques, um, but this one brush was probably about 10 or $15, um, but the BH Cosmetics brushes came in a set, but I did purchase the, a smaller version of the brush. Um, this came from Ulta Beauty. It's their, um, I think it's called, yes, Precision Foundation Brush. It's the um, number 12. And it's about $16, and I did use it today to apply my foundation, and I like it. Um, I purchased some more of the ColourPop Super Shot Shadows. This time I got the shade Mighty Morphin, and I also purchased um, Mint For You. I purchased one of their blushes. Let's see, the ColourPop Pressed Powder Blush. It's in the shade Toffee Cake. The packaging kind of looks like strawberry shortcake to me. I think that's so cute. <laughs> and the little shade. Um, I don't have um, anything this shade in my currently in my collection, so that's why I picked it up. I also purchased a primer brush from e.l.f. So I used it today to apply my primer and my moisturizer. And then I have a new highlighter, but I haven't opened it yet. This is the Hard Candy Rose Gold Highlighter. Um, it's kind of like a, a trio, um, trio compact. There's a, like a yellowish gold. Um, there's a peachy color and then this mauve um, color on the end. I purchased this from Walmart. And then I have another palette. This is the Makeup Obsession Warm Up Palette. Um, I purchased this from Marshalls for $4.99. And I like this palette because you can use it for eyeshadow, blush, highlight, bronzer, and or contour if you would like. So you don't have to um, carry a lot of makeup if you're going somewhere and you're trying to minimize the items that you take. This would be ideal for that. And again, this was from... Um, Marshalls and I actually swatched the colors when I got it but it swatches pretty well too and I'm not even I'm barely touching the um, palette running out of 
fingers to swatch. There's like a um a light um, beige color in here. That's like the only one that's not um, really really pigmented, and I would probably use it to clean up under my um, eyebrows with this color right here. It looks darker on camera, but it's not really as dark. Um, so you have three browns, some mauve tones, and that gold. And then I purchased, a, um, I'm wearing it on my lips and still almost forgot. So I have on an e.l.f. liquid matte lipstick. It's in the shade T-Rose. And it was only $2.99. I'm actually just getting in from taking my kids to the skating rink tonight on a school night. Um, <laughs> so I'm I'm going to actually start winding uh, winding down for the night, um, cleaning my face, and getting prepared for tomorrow because I have to work. I'm probably going to include some clips from the skating rink on this video. But that is all that I have for you all. Hope that everyone is doing well. Be blessed. Bye-bye.